Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and we're going to be looking at a new game called Camping Simulator. Uh, it is on Steam for $5, and I just have to let you guys know right off the bat, there is no save system yet, uh, but the developers know about it, and they are working on it. No, they obviously didn't know about it. They are working on it. There's going to be a save system. Um, strangely enough, this game actually has multiplayer in it, which is very, very odd for a game in this early development, but that is pretty cool. Um, I did play it for a little bit, and it seems like a pretty fun game, so we're going to get started here. Uh, yeah, not having a save file, <laughs> that's a pretty tough proposition for me personally, but I don't know, the game seems pretty cool. I'm going to take a look. So, you can do classic forest, a realistic forest experience with limited resources. It can be difficult to find food and drink in nature. You have to find your direction using your compass. There are three main camping areas, weather and climate are generally warm. And then there's snowy hills. A realistic snow camping experience with limited resources. You know, this reminds me of, I watch a dude on YouTube called uh, Matthew Poza. And he, like, goes winter camping and like, freaking two feet of snow and stuff. Oh, really good videos. Uh, he goes out with his dog. Really cool videos. It can be difficult. You know, it says the same stuff. Explore the caves and survive at least two days. Reach to the summit. Weather and climate are generally very cold. I wouldn't have guessed. All right, so we're going to start right here, and we are all ready, and right away you're going to be able to take a bunch of stuff with you. Now, I made the mistake of loading up, and that I really couldn't loot much, so we're going to look through our stuff right now. Uh, they give you everything you need to start a tent, or to set up a tent, which is great. Uh, you're going to need this grill, and this, uh, what, mocha pot, I guess? Um, <laughs> you know, and I got a compass, an axe, and a knife, so that looks pretty good. We've also got uh, five bottles of water, all right? It's wait a minute. All this is in the oh, that's right. This is the stuff I could take. This okay, fair enough. Let's go to our camping stuff, and we got to make sure we have a pocket knife. And I believe don't I start with one? Yeah, I'm not seeing one. All right, so we're gonna take the pocket knife. I don't know what a walkie-talkie is for, so I'm gonna leave that out. Uh, a gas cooker. I don't think I like got a chance to cook with the gas cooker in my test game, but I'll take that. Uh, we're also gonna take a fishing rod for fishing. I don't know what a dining cloth is for. But I do know we need a lot of duct tape, so I'm going to take, like, like 10 duct tape. Maybe even more. We'll see. Um, I don't know what items are for at all. I don't know if these items are for anything. It just says, like, a plate, just a plate. Big pot, just a pot. Like, I don't really know what any of this stuff is for. I, I, I'm starting to think it's not really used for anything. What would I use a battery for? Uh, the flashlight. Eh, you know, they're pretty light. I'll take a couple batteries. Why not? I don't really think this stuff's used for anything. Maybe it is, maybe it's not. I really don't know. Alright. So now we're going to go to food. And obviously food's going to be important. I love peaches. So we're going to take five, six peaches. We're going to take... I've already got five water. We're going to take another... Another ten water. You get thirsty before you get... Does peaches give you thirst? Yeah, see peaches, if you look on the bottom left-hand side. Peaches does give you thirst. The stats right there are... Thirst, hunger... Uh, energy, and I don't know what Z's are. Maybe, like, like you'd have something that puts you to sleep. Like the beer? No, I guess not. Alright. I'm gonna take a couple of these. And I think that's pretty good. I Honestly, I don't want to weigh myself down. I really don't. All the food and drink, man. <laughs> I might regret not taking a, nut, a lot of this. We'll take eight. Okay. Let's just go. Start game. I don't know what start game not ready means. Maybe I'm supposed to, like, completely load up. I, I don't know. But we're going to go ahead and start the game now. <clears throat> yeah, man. Camping Simulator sounds pretty dope. All right. So those are all our settings. Fight mode. Fight mode. Hit you with my axe, brah. Can I actually get that rabbit? I don't know. I'm going to pick up wood along the way. Yeah, in my test game, I loaded up in the beginning. So when I, when I got out here, I couldn't pick anything up. So it doesn't really help much if you do that. Um, ooh, bones? <laughs> Can't pick up the bones. So you automatically climb up these rocks when you come up to them. Alright. Um, go to the campsite. Okay, this is the map. Alright, there we are. Right there. Here I am pointing at the screen like you guys can see me. Um, yeah, if you, you could zoom in like this. Look around. We got our compass. Alright, let's put that away. And let's keep on keeping on. I don't know of any bows or arrows. I don't really know how I'm supposed to maybe catch rabbits i don't know uh i'm assuming you know considering there's no save system in the game yet uh the game's in super early access 
That's just just what I'm assuming. I don't know a lot about this game. I haven't been following it for long, but I saw camping and simulator, and I'm like, okay, yeah. Yeah, this is pretty cool. So, all right, you could fight even w without an axe. Attack, punch, throw, kick. Oh, throw, kick, huh? Oh! <laughs> kick! Kick! All right, let's get our axe back. That's it. <laughs> That's my lifeline, dude. I'm not going to throw my axe. <laughs> like, what are the chances? I'm not some axe thrower. I don't know. Maybe, maybe my guy is an axe thrower. I think if I press Q, I could, like, throw stones. Yep, there we go. Like a hobbit. I'm like a freaking hobbit. But some people don't... I was watching some people do reactions to the Lord of the Rings movies. And what a lot of people don't know, if you don't read the books, is that um, hobbits are extremely adept at throwing, throwing stones. They're really, really, like, deadly. Like, seriously. That's something they were good at in the books. Never talk about it in the in the movies, though. Alright, so we are now full, so we will keep on keeping on. I don't know if you're supposed to have, like, a camp in this game. You would set up a camp for the night, um, but I don't think you're meant to stay in one spot. It seems, like, pretty nomad at the time. So, we'll have to see how that goes. And we will climb up here. And here's our first campsite. Alright, so we need to open our inventory for some reason. And now we need to clear out the bushes so we could set up a tent. So we're just going to go... Now, this is a simulator game, so be prepared for this kind of stuff. Just wait until you see me put up the tent. <laughs> there we go. And we will clear you out as well. There we go. Digging it up. Honestly, you didn't really need to... I could have just put my tent down here. I don't know... What was the point of this, maybe? I, I don't know. On the bottom left-hand side, I do have a, uh, a little gauge showing my, my body temperature. And I guess it's going up because I'm, I'm exerting myself. And then obviously we have food and drink and z z z z z z z z z where I need to sleep. All right, so now we need to set up the tent. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go to this thing right here, which is the tent foundation, and put that down. And I will rotate it like so. Alright, then you got to take the poles. You got long tent pole. And those go in the middle. Alright, there we go. Did I do that one right? Yeah. Even if you don't hit it like where, exactly where you're supposed to, it'll just kind of snap into place. As long as it's green, you're good. And this guy's got some kind of freaking thing going on. He can't like sit still. He's always moving around and stuff. All right, so once you put in all the poles, then I believe you put down the tent. And we're going to have this face this way. All right, I, guess, I think this will snap into place as well. Here, let's try it. Yep. Oh, darn it, it's going the wrong way. That's eh, fine. Oh, boy, it's getting dark. Place and drive-in stakes. Okay. So we have these little um, tent stakes. I need to come over here, and you need to put them in. And we'll put them in there. You kind of just click the button and it goes in. And then once you put them in the ground, you have to uh, hammer them down. And I think this takes like four hammer strokes. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Like four sets. That's three. And, f oh, three? Oh, well, let's count that again. All right, guys, count with me. All right, counting with cage. One. Two. Three. Okay, yeah, three sets. Cool. And three. Beautiful. Toggle the flashlight. Okay, very good. I'm assuming that thing does have a battery on it. Um, I don't see any battery indicator, so either that's not, you know, in the game yet, or drop. I don't see any way to inspect it either. I'm not sure. Or maybe it just goes out when it's done. You won't know until it goes out. All right, collect wood for the campfire. Dude, I already have, like, a bunch of wood on me. That doesn't count. It's going to want me to collect stone, too. Darn it. I already collected all this stuff. All right, whatever. There's plenty in the area. Should I collect that rabbit, too? Oh, we got a thing over there. We got to loot that before we go. All right. So now we have to do some crafting. I would never set this up like this. I would set the tent up this way. So I can see what's coming. Right here. What am I looking at? I mean, it's a nice view, but it's not going to save me if something's coming up from behind me. Alright, so crafting. There we go. So, 
Yep, see, you need this pocket knife for almost everything. Huh. Big stones going to small stones? Makes sense. I don't know how to make rope. I told you I was going to need duct tape for everything. Um, I already have a fishing pole, so it doesn't matter. A uh, small trap would be good, though. Alright, well, this game wants me to make a campfire, so I will do that. Can take a little bit of time. I'm going to MacGyver it up. It's going to be good to go. Okay, we'll put that right there. Close enough to give me residual heat, but not too close where it's going to light the thing on fire. Alright, now it says uh, place a grill on the campfire and then the mocha pot. Okay. Use. And use. You can, uh, you can set up a tent and sleep so the time passes faster until the morning. Okay. So place a sleeping bag and go to sleep. Am I not going to use that mocha pot for anything? or? Alright, I like to put... Before I was putting my tent long ways. Or I was putting my sleeping bag long ways in the tent. Because it kind of made more sense to me. But you want to put it sideways so you can see outside the tent. Because if you can't... Oh, damn it. It's the wrong way. Alright, hold on. Let's try that again. Because if you can't see outside the tent... Um, you can't really tell when it's getting light out. You don't just sleep until morning and then you get up. You gotta like... I think you gotta like see outside the tent. I don't know. Maybe not, but... I do want to see outside the tent. Come on. There we go. Now I can see my uh, my cooking pot. That's awesome. It said time is supposed to go faster when you're sleeping. Um, I don't know if there's like a ding, it's morning, or uh, I can't tell how fast time's going. It does look like it's getting pretty bright out though. So, yeah, without the ability to save. Oh, there we go. Without the ability to save, it's going to be a little tough. It's going to be a little tough, but that will be coming, I'm sure. Okay, have a breakfast. I will have a breakfast. Some peaches. There we go. Where's my can opener? I don't have a can opener, but I'm eating peaches. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. All right, pack up my. It says pack up the tent. I'm gonna. I'm gonna just do the tent first because it says pack up the tent. But I also am supposed to pack up my mocha pot in the grill. But I don't know. Maybe it'll give me that option after this. Okay, now actually getting the tent is a little tricky. I couldn't get it to highlight last time. Is it actually highlighting the tent? No. Um, I couldn't get it to highlight the tent last time. Maybe I gotta do the... Oh, yeah, I can't, I can't do these first. So I gotta figure out how to get the tent. Oh, did I get it? No. See, it's not really... It's not highlighting the tent. Zoom. Zoom, zoom. No, oh, that's highly in the tent. There we go. I didn't see the pickup option. Eh, maybe I just missed it. Maybe I'm going crazy. Been out here in the wilderness for too long. It's been 18 hours, man. I'm losing it. All right, so you just you pick up everything the way you put it down, and there you go. So explore the cave. So am I going? Am I leaving this area or not? I'll pick all that up as well. Inventory's full. All right, we got to do some. Uh, Got to do some work here. So yeah, the inventory like fills up so freaking quick. Oh, because I got eight logs on me. I'm assuming I can find logs everywhere. Yep. Drop, 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 drop. There should be a drop all button. Drop all option. Okay. That cleared up some space. All right, I'm going to take that and I'm going to loot this bag over here. See what this bag's got in it. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Pick all. Inventory full. Did I get everything, though? Looks like I did. I had just enough space for everything. That doesn't... Wait, pick. Hold on. Pick. Pick all. Sounds like picking your nose. Can I put that on my back? I, th I thought maybe it would be an upgrade or something. Boo. All right, let's see. All right, so we're 44, 45. So we had just enough, just enough space. Man, I want to pick up that freaking bag, dude. Um, do I even have a bag on me? Yeah, I do. Big stone in the way. There we go. Yeah, big bag. Okay, all right. So enter the cave. So where's the cave? Is it close? I, don't, I can't tell. Let's look at our map. Nope, it's not close. All right, we're going to stay on the road. We are going to stay on the road. All right, well, I'm glad we got everything out of that bag. That was uh, quite helpful. Or maybe, oh, I need the rope. I know I need the rope for some of the crafting I'm going to have to do. Now, setting up traps. The idea that I could set up, like, traps 
leads me to believe that I am actually going to be able to stay in one spot. Like, find a camper and set up because, you know, traps aren't mobile. You know what I mean? So. Alright, cool. Let's get to this cave. Oh, there's a snake after me. Do snakes usually chase people? I thought snakes... I, I was under the impression that snakes would bite as a defensive measure. Crap, what was that? Slide! Whee! What was that tutorial thing? If you ever miss a tutorial option, you can look through here. I just don't know what that said. If you set up a campfire in the in the area you are camping, dangerous animals will stay away from you. Oh, okay. Oops, I'm getting bit. I'm getting bit. Son of a freaking stupid snake. Um, he took out like half my hit points in like one shot. You can craft a trap for hunting animals in the crafting menu. Is he coming at me? Did he stop? Should I turn my back on him? He's gonna freaking keep coming. Do I have any way to heal? Food, drink, distribute. Uh, I don't know if I have any way to heal. Oh god. Pull the bear to the trap. What trap? Crap. Small stone. I don't see a trap. So am I supposed to make a trap or is I missed something? Darn it. Alright, the only thing I can think of is I'm supposed to make my own trap. It might have told me that, um, but I don't know. I missed it. So let's go ahead and make our own trap. Um, are these are there any difference? No. Nah. Um, oh, it's just the different kinds of cans you use. Fair enough. Craft. By the way, I'm getting hit points back over time. So as far as I can tell, that's the only way to get hit points back. Alright, so we're going to put that right there. And then I'm going to go ahead and pick up my... Uh, oh, <laughs> he's dead. Okay, fair enough. So I threw some stuff on the ground I kind of want. Uh, like right there. Whatever that is. Is that what I wanted? Yeah. I, th I had to throw down my um my sleeping bag. And the gas cooker. I can take the gas cooker now. Alright. Go camp zone too. Can I do anything with the bear? I can't even carve him up or anything. Wait, what am I doing? Oh, I am carving them up. Okay, I didn't see an option for it. I just started hitting buttons. I'm not going to be able to hold any of this stuff. The inventory is a bit of a problem. Wait, did I get anything? Oh, yeah, I did. Cool. Very good. All right, well, let's... Do I, do I have to go through here to get to the next campsite? Yes, I do. Okay. That's what I thought. Should I pick some mushrooms? Why not? Can I eat mushrooms? Uh, they don't do anything for you. Okay, I'm going to drop them then. I'll be very careful what I take. Ooh, an oil lamp. Wait, can I pick it up? A gas lamp. Huh. It's kind of weird I can't pick it up. Uh, canned food, gas cooker, axe. Yeah, I, I can't really loot any of this stuff. I just <laughs> can't hold anything. I wonder if I have something on me I'm not supposed to have. That's weighing me down so much. Maybe I shouldn't have taken so much drink. That stuff's not that, like, heavy, though. The drink. It's mainly the, um, the, the tent. Uh, maybe I took too much duct tape? I don't know. Maybe. Not really sure. This is all new to me. Can't fire. I'm not burning. Alright, well, I'm not gonna stay here, so it doesn't... Wait, am I gonna stay here? It looks like it might be getting dark. Nah, I think we're good. Let's go to the next... Wait, I don't see the thing. Go to, go to camp zone two. I see it. Alright, yeah, let's go, to, let's go to camp zone two. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> it is getting dark. Alright, fine, we'll stay here. Let's set up everything. Hey guys, I'm just sitting at the campfire, cooking up some food. Uh, I wish you could get rid of that menu while sitting at the campfire. I want to look at the food, but I'm looking at a menu. Yeah, so if you uh, click on the campfire, you can like do all kinds of things. You can start the fire, extinguish the fire, sit at the fire, add wood. Each wood gives you five minutes of cooking. And that meat will be done in 19 seconds, so that is cool. I might bring a, I might bring a good amount less food next time. Uh, how much does that weigh? Yeah, the canned food is um, 0.4 kilograms. I guess kilograms? So, yeah, I might want to bring next food, less food next time. I'm really battling the... <clears throat> I'm really battling the, uh... Wait, is it meat raw? Is that done yet? It doesn't say it's cooking anymore. 
One foods left. I'm not sure what that means. Yep, there we go. Cool. Let's go ahead and eat it. Healthy food. Whoops. Don't drop it, buddy. Eat it. There you go. Yeah, I probably don't need this much food. I mean, I didn't bring a ton of food, but... I don't know how to get water out here, though. That's the only thing. Alright, cool. Let's go to sleep. There we go. And now we're just waiting for morning. Alright, I'm kind of interested on how the game is going to work during the night. So, I'm going to actually try and get to the next point during the night. I'm assuming I'm, I'm probably going to freeze. I don't know, but it doesn't seem to really be a problem right now. So, I guess I'm not going to worry about it. There we go. Climb up here. We're going to get to that next campsite. New zone. Go to camp zone 2. Ah, oh, freaking snake. Oh, man. I hate those damn snakes. Oh, boy. Here we go. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Surprised that wasn't like a mini game. Trying to keep your balance. Wow. Yeah. That is not... Not cool. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's kind of weird that the next zone is not showing up, like, on my screen. It always did on the other ones, but... Uh, hiking trail. Please don't litter. Not the boss of me. Here, how about this? How you like that? I'll litter where I want. No, actually, that's not really that good. Because meat is just organic. It, here, let's throw some plastic on the ground. There you go. Suck on that, Mother Nature. <laughs> uh, oh, there it is. We're almost there. Yeah, it didn't seem like uh, uh, if you set up a campfire in the area. Yeah, we got that. It didn't seem like... Um, climb up. There you go. Yeah, it, pretty, it, it seems like you can pretty much travel like anytime you want during the night. During the night. Um, so I don't even know if you have to sleep. I know you, I know you have to sleep. There's a little... Z, 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 Z meter there, but... Okay. So let's go ahead and set up here. Have a safe night. Oh, okay. So this is the one where if you don't set up a campfire, stuff's going to come in and, and, and freaking bang you around. Chew on your face, you know? You are getting thirsty. Oh, freaking snake. Can I fight it? Let's fight it. Yeah, suck on that, you punk ass snake. Freaking bitch ass snake. I freaking hate those things. Uh, you can split big lo big logs on the chop log. Oh, please. Oh, okay. I was just on my other campfire. I was just throwing logs right on there, but we could split unless big logs into uh, on the chop log. What the hell a chop log is? It's something I can make. Go ahead and get rid of all this stuff. Set up our tent. Unless I should do a campfire first. You know, we should probably do a campfire first. <clears throat> Maybe it'll keep the snakes away. Oh, there's a chop log. Okay. Alright, so crafting campfire. Oh boy. <laughs> I don't know anything. Cause you you What the hell is that? I didn't like the sound of that. Cause you can't carry anything around because you don't have any like space. You have to like leave stuff and then gather stuff and you get to a new campsite. Chop log wood. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. Flashlight. Uh, inventory's full. Damn it. Yeah, I'm, I'm really, like, fighting against the inventory here, man. Like, oh, let's go ahead and drop that. Uh, I only have one log. Yeah. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw my camp, my camp, uh, my tent down. Just, just drop it. For now. Yeah, the inventory is a little bit strict. But I guess it's supposed to be. Where are the freaking stone? Damn bear. Alright, bro. We're gonna dance. <laughs> okay, <laughs> it didn't work. Get help. Otherwise, you're going, you are going to respawn in 20 seconds. Is there any way I can, like, cancel that? I guess that's part of the multiplayer part of the game. People can, like, help you up and stuff. Well, the bear spawn camping me. Um, I kept all my stuff when I respawned, but the thing is, I dropped my tent up there. So, I kind of need my tent. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and get up there in a different spot and set up a bear trap. 
I don't know if I can actually do that. Uh, I can't jump. There's no jump in the game, so I'm not sure how to get up there. Except for exactly where the freaking bear is. Um, okay, well. Let's see if we can do this. Craft. Maybe I can put it up there from down here. Kind of have to try that out. Mm, kinda. Hold on. Let's see if we can do this. I definitely can put it behind him. Come on. Oh, you're killing me. Alright, get up there. And then run to the right. <laughs> Did not work. Okay, well. <laughs> I think it might be screwed here because my, my tent's up there. You know, I can't save the game anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna try one more one more try. See if I can see if I could trap him somehow and get up there and get my stuff. I could throw rocks at him. I threw rocks at him though. I'm not a hobbit. So it didn't really do anything. He kinda of laughed at it. You won. Okay. And this is where we spawn. We are right here. So we just have to run back up this way. Yeah, I might be screwed. I should have got that campfire up a little quicker. Maybe you got a bear trap. I mean, I could have probably put a bear trap. Can I pack up a bear trap? Uh, see, I should be able to pack up a bear trap. So far, this game seems pretty cool. I'm pretty interested in it. The only thing that's really killing me about it is the inventory. The, the, the inventory is really strict. It's by far the hardest part of the game. There's probably little tricks and stuff I could do. Take this, don't take that. Um, I mean, I don't know if I need a gas cooker, to be honest. I probably don't. Uh, and that's kind of heavy. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Um, the fishing rod was heavy. I didn't use it. Um, too, many, too much duct tape. I don't know what the hell I'm carrying a chair around for. <laughs> like, for real. Uh, drop. I mean, I, I understand. Like, chairs are comfy, but, you know, come on. Uh, yeah, this stuff seems pretty good. I guess I don't need the batteries. And um, probably too much drink. And probably, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't think I've, I don't think that's too much food. I mean, do you, do you not want to have food? So the tent's really heavy, though. The tent and the and the uh, the sleeping bag and stuff. So you know, just gotta be uh, a little more careful. Because if I had the wood, I could have set that campfire quicker and theoretically kept the bear away. So let's go up there and see if he's in the area. When I first went up there, stupid freaking snake. <laughs> I just, I walked right into him. I saw the snake. I stepped on his head. He bit me. What a surprise. All right. I managed to get up on the area where the bear is, I think, and not be like right on top of him. So I might have a chance to lure him over here. We need to lure him. All right. Come on. There you go. Can I not go this way? Hmm. Seems to be an invisible wall here. I, I don't think I can get over to the bear. I don't think the game's going to let me. Son of a bee. Yeah, I think I might be screwed. It looks like that trap has gone off. I wonder if I stepped on the trap. Can you step on your own trap? I didn't think you could, but maybe I did. All right, can we get up this way? Come on. Come on. Get on up there. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. I think we're screwed. Come on. Come on. Yeah! Suck on that, you piece of crap bear. What'd you get? I, I really wonder if I stepped on that, <laughs> that trap because the bear didn't die. And, <laughs> and the trap was set off. So, yeah. Alright, let's uh let's do some crafting here. Do I have everything I need for the campfire? Nope, not even close. See, they don't put a lot of resources up here. I don't think you can chop down trees either for wood. Which is kinda not good. But it does rhyme. Yeah, you have to you have to get the wood before you go up there. Probably the stone as well. Um two more wood and one more stone. Two more wood and one more stone. That's a small stone, it's not what I need. It's a freaking wood, man. Why can't I chop down the trees? Maybe you can chop down the trees now. I, I don't know how. 
I went. I took out the axe earlier and swung it at the trees. Didn't do anything. All right, that's it for the stone. And we just need one more piece of wood, please. I've used so much wood on the freaking bear traps. Come on. There we go. I think that spawned in, too. So I'm supposed to uh, craft a, and place a small trap to hunt rabbits. We will do that after the night. Ran out of energy. Okay. That's stamina, basically. Let's go ahead and set up a campfire. Crafting. Craft. And this hopefully will keep the animals away. Alright, so I should be able to... Oh man, I don't have any freaking wood, man. <laughs> it's not gonna... It's not gonna work. Is there any wood over here? Small stone. Oh, there's a piece. Alright, cool. Take that. And that. Let's see if I can actually hold my axe. See, those are items. And I can't even, like... I don't even see the axe. Oh, here we go. Camping. Yeah, use. Well, use. Hold on. Yeah. See? I think the wood just spawns on the ground. Alright, let's go over to this uh, chopping... Oh, there's some. So now it's starting to spawn. So how do we do this? E. Place wood first. Alright, items. Use. E. Oh, beautiful. Wood chopped. Okay, so that can be two pieces, or... No, it's going to be one split wood. Wait, how come I put a full wood on there, and I only got one split wood? <laughs> how does that work? Did I miss it? Or Yeah, there it is. Okay, I was going to say. So I know one log gives you ten or five minutes burn time. Let's see how much one of these gives. Wait. Don't you put these on the campfire? Oh, do I have to chop it again? Maybe I have to chop it again. No, I'm not... I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. Craft and place small trap to hunt rabbits. Okay, fair enough. Do I have what I need to place those? E no. But I will. Find a piece of stone down here. I did see some rabbits down here. I don't know if you have to place the traps where the rabbits are. You know, or if you just put it wherever. And it'll catch rabbits. But I'm gonna put it where the rabbits are, because why not? Wait, I just picked up a... Oh, I need a small stone. Oh, I'm not used to needing small stones. So far, I've only needed big stones for stuff. I think there's another small stone right here somewhere. There we go. Alright, and then we will craft and put this down here. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with those half logs. Okay, so there's a pretty good spot for it. Wait, two of them? Really? That's interesting. Well, I mean, I guess this makes sense. So, am I going to be, like, staying here, though? Because if, if I'm not going to be staying here, why would I put these down? Like, I don't think you can pick them up and take them with you. Alright, without noticing, I kind of use slides to get down to the fishing point. So, if you look where I am, I think I have to go all the way that way and around to get back to my camp zone. So, I don't think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to mess around some fishing. So, let's grab this. Okay. Is that a hat in the water? Why is there a hat in the water? Oh, that's it? So there's no, like, skill or anything involved in this? You just kind of catch stuff? I guess so. Catch fish, catch fish. I got my own, um, my own fishing rod. So I guess you don't need to, you don't need to take a fishing rod either, guys. Because there's one right here. Interesting. Well, live and learn, right? <clears throat> Alright, are we going to catch anything? There we go. Cool. That big fish? Eh, oh, it's a small fish, but I'll take it. And we don't need... To, we really don't need the chair. Because there's a chair right here. Alright, cool. Let me see if I can... Uh, can I get out of this thing? There we go. I have to left click to get out. And there's my fish. Cool. Very cool. Alright guys, I do think I am going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying this video, you know, make sure you leave a leave a like and everything. Let me know in the comments. Any tips and stuff are welcome. 
Uh, I will definitely revisit it again when it gets a save feature. And um, it's a pretty interesting game. You know, it's the kind of game you kind of keep an eye on and see where it goes. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. Mm -hmm.